I joined Eastern Security Network for revenge. Dismissed Surya confessed. Police operatives in Imo State has apprehended one Godwin Chukwemeka, popularly known as March and Die, who was apprehended over the weekend for his alleged part in the Owerri job break, which happened earlier this year. The Imo State Police Commissioner Abuta Yaru, while parading the suspect at the police headquarters in Owerri, said that the dismissed army officer was apprehended from his hideout along Owerri Nekede Road. It learned that the suspect was apprehended based on intelligence reports on his criminal activities. Reports also have it that the 35-year-old was paraded inside a ceiling of his residence after he heard the police was looking seriously for him. After his arrest, he was taken to the police headquarters with all the incriminating items that were recovered from him and was rejected to a very serious interrogations, which he later confessed of being a runaway soldier who left the army and was dismissed because of his dubious activities. According to him, he added that he is an indigent of Ungo Opala in Imo State and he ran from the military after he was told to abandon his education as an HND2 student at the Federal Polytechnic Nekede. He added that he is a strong member of the IPOP team who have been terrorizing the police station in the state. The suspect confessed that he had to join IPOP because he was dismissed from the army and he is one of the persons supplying these hoodlums with guns which they used in attacking police stations in the state. So far so many police stations have been attacked and so many prisons have been broken and so many criminals have been set free. The police operatives are still conducting series of investigations to uncover the rest of the suspect in the hideout and also the arrested dismissed officers will be charged to court as soon as possible. My dear viewers, you see that you are looking for uh, dangerous human beings, dangerous human beings. You see them in the Nigerian military. The Nigerian military are the one producing the criminals that we have today. The criminals we have today, the stupid um, gunmen that we are seeing today in the southeast, that they are pointing and accusing fingers at the Eastern Security Network, are those dismissed soldiers. That is to tell you that our Nigerian army produce criminals. They produce criminals. That is what they do. They don't do any other thing apart from producing criminals. Look at this very one now. Eh? Look at this very one. What are we going to say this very one is? You can see the stupid lies lying that is a member of Eastern Security Network, which is complete lie. He left the army to be... You see, many of these criminals, after um, being apprehended as probably a gun, as one of the gunmen, they will now, look, they will now um, think of, okay, which of these group that is more recognized in Nigeria that they can use as a cover-up so that, so that they, can be, they can be granted safety. So many of them are of this opinion of using IPOP because they know IPOP is a recognized group with a with, uh, with lot of guarantor and uh, reliable guarantors. So they believe that they may, when they use IPOP or Eastern Security Network, they will be granted safety and they will be they will be safe. You see, that's what they do, and that's why you see many of the criminal gunmen that are caught, you know, appearing on TV, lying and claiming that uh, they were uh, they, they, they they are part of the Eastern Security Network. When we say that um, is a member, when we say is the is the is the is the is the, uh, uh, the leader. But in fact, I don't know. 
Look at this very one. Huh? Look at this very one. You don't want to see. I don't know why many people join the army for nothing. So many people join army because of intimidation, because of frustration, because of lack of job. In fact, most of the Nigerian, most of our Nigerians join the army because of lack of job in our country. Because there is no job in our country, that is why many of them join the army. That's why many of them join the army. So when they look their left, they look their right, there is no job. What else? So go and join the army. Huh? So it doesn't, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. It, so I'll, and I'll say that in this in this aspect, our country contributes to the, to these factors. Look at, look at, listen to what the young man have to say. That he, he, he was forced to leave his studies in order to continue with the Nigerian army. You would have finished your studies. That would, would have given you an edge, an edge of becoming a good uh, soldier. You see, that's why proper orientations are very, very important. Very important. Both, most especially in the life of kids, children. Very important. We are the cause of our problems. We are the cause of many of the problems we are going through. We, 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 we in particular the cause. We are the cause. And why? What do you mean of all this? Despite your personality, your look at look, see how young he is. See how young he is. Many people you see today that are soldiers today, many of them join the army because of intimidation. Because of intimidation and fear. Many of them like that. That's what they do. Eh? That's what they do. And it doesn't go well. It doesn't. I don't I don't subscribe to that. And I don't give in to that to that shit. Of what gain and of what use have, is that going to do to you? Okay, see how he has made a mess of his personality, of his studies, of his um, uh, reputation, and also of his name. It's not a must. It's not a must. If there is no job in the country, what you need to do, um, just pray and then look for um, something to do with your bare hands. That's why I, for once, value skill, 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 hand skill.